Ciao Italy, this is DJ Kiar Lee from South Korea. Now I'm in Sweden for my new recording deal with the Swedish recording company. Uh, the owners of the company are um, a famous TV host and a former uh, Swedish idol jury. So my new career in Sweden will be quite interesting. So hope you guys tune on my new journey in Sweden. I, um, I actually started my career as an event organizer back in South Korea. Uh, while uh, my events were getting bigger and bigger all the time, because um, so it went to a completely a different level, the whole lot of a diff different level from the small party at a small bar to the events where the thousands of people join. And then uh, while I'm doing the event organizing, I got to meet uh, so many different DJs from so many different countries and also um, so many people suggested me to become a female DJ So because it, it was a niche market. So um, And I used to be a conductor back in my school, so I was pretty talented and interested in music in general. So I thought like, okay, maybe it would be a good combination with the DJing and the event organizing job. So I. I, that's how I started my DJ career. So um, when I was a teenager, I used to listen to a lot of K-pop. But after that, I was more into like American pop music. And then ever since I started the event uh, organizing, of course, I was more into like club music. The gig I, I loved the most was the gig in Malaysia for the New Year's Eve party last year. When I was there for my gig, I, uh, I had such an um, impressive or different uh, experience there. Because Malaysia is still a, uh, Malaysia is a Muslim country, so I had to wear a long sleeve with the long pants on the stage. So it was so hot and humid and I was wearing the full outfit covered everywhere on my part of the body. But I got to uh, play in front of thousands of thousands of people in the open area for the New Year's Eve and I made the New Year's Eve countdown as well. So the advice to the people who are interested in getting into this industry. Uh, um, first of all, you're welcome to this industry. but. If you're really ser serious about doing this job as, an, as your exclusive career, other than the other jobs, I think you have to be very well prepared and uh, get ready for it. Uh, probably it would be a lot of plus if you have a lot of money saved up because it takes so, such a long time to build your career in the beginning, uh, so many years probably. Uh, because it's harder than you think. It's um, I've seen so many, even so many K-pop stars who try to start their um, DJ career, but not many were very successful. Probably you haven't heard any K-pop stars who uh, has been successful as a DJ yet, even if they were, they are so many out there already. So uh, it's very hard to get your name out in the beginning. And also, it requires a lot of talent, not only the music talent, and you have to know a lot about the software for the produ producing. And not only that, if you want to just play and mix the songs that exist in the world, you have to know a lot about the DJ equipment. And also, you have to be well connected with the society because you have to get gigs somewhere. Um, if you need any advice, please ask me again. Thank you guys so much for watching my interview and I love Italy. I cannot wait to meet all the Italian fans in Italy someday. And don't forget to subscribe or like my Facebook page or Instagram. You can just easily find me as a username Chiara Lee Official or you can just easily Google my name Chiara Lee on Google. That might, uh, that might be a bit easier. So, I uh, hope you guys enjoyed my video and love you. Ciao, Italy!